Do you dare walk under a ladder? Because that's what we're talking about today. Hello, by the way. I haven't even said hello. <laughs> um, superstitions. Um, basically, it stems from this story in the papers today, which is saying that tourists who pinched relics from Pompeii are returning them in droves, saying that they're cursed. Now, Jane, <laughs> you just went straight under that ladder. I did, and I'm still Not here. bothered. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing has happened. What a load of old bunk. Is the hour <laughs> is young. <laughs> No, what about bunkum? I just don't know. It's rubbish. Oh. It's rubbish. It's things that get passed on through families, you know. And it's a bit like um, I don't know. If someone's got OCD, a therapist will challenge them to alter their behaviour. So they'll say, okay, if I don't, um, you know, if I do walk into that door without washing my hands after touching that doorknob, look, nothing bad has happened. Mm. Superstitions are like a very sort of mild variation of that. We kind of buy into it. But what is really going to happen when you walk under a ladder or...? You get paint pot on your head. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, you're more likely to get the paint pot the other side cos the builder's going to be on the ladder this side with his paint pot. But I think you're right, cos I do. I force myself, like, I force myself to go under there. Did and I spend all day going, what's going to happen? Like, at the moment, I've got a box of new shoes on the table on purpose. <gasps> really? Yes. You rebel. Yes. <laughs> I'm trying to... Ah! Tempting fate. Do you? Yeah. We wouldn't do it then. Do you know, I'm not superstitious about most things, but Friday the 13th, I am. So much so that my baby was due on Friday the 13th, and the doctor in charge, I said, I don't want him on Friday the 13th, <laughs> and she totally understood. She got me. Yeah. So he was induced, and I had him on the 12th. <laughs> yeah, because I had... Years back, I had a really bad day on Friday the 13th. I had three car crashes in one day. <laughs> Not my fault, they hit me. <laughs> I then locked the car, the third car of the day, put my handbag on the roof whilst I was locking the car. This was in the days before you could, you know, <laughs> the electronic things. Put my handbag on the roof and got mugged, got pushed over, got thumped, and then whipped my handbag. And that all happened on the Friday. The <laughs> 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 I don't go out. That is not funny. What happens <laughs> with all the other people on the roads who didn't have a car crash on Friday the 13th? Well, I didn't bother. No, Jane, 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 you cannot blame her. She, was, she had three car crashes and a mugging. Okay. On the I'm not blaming her. I'm no, just you saying stay in. You there's stay a in. lot of people on Friday the 13th that that didn't happen And to. also, Hilary, what if you'd had it on, I don't know, a Tuesday the 22nd? Does that mean then on every Tuesday the 22nd you might not have... You know, it might just have been an unlucky no, it day. It happened not... on Friday the 13th and my baby was due. Right. God bless you, man. My right. baby was due on yeah. Friday what's the gonna 13th. Yeah. What's she going to do? What's she going to do now? No, so, that, that, that bit I understand. Not having oh, no, the, the what's baby. she going to do? What? No, no. <laughs> no. No, 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 I think we should change the subject. OK, let's change the subject. Um, OK, how about this, then? Uh, Nuri... <laughs> You're so aggressive the way you took your shoes off. <laughs> I've got bits of broken glass everywhere. <laughs> you see? You see, you wouldn't have that. <laughs>